Big Castle is the one who likes to get in the way. I'm sure Little Castle will be a pleasure. Sam Parker, age 38, lives in Connecticut with his wife, Helen, and his two kids. Wife's en route to the morgue to ID the body. We contacted the leasing office, and they don't have a Sam Parker listed as a tenant. So he probably was visiting someone. Uniforms are canvassing, no hits yet. CSU's working to untangle the prints, but since it's a common room, there's probably dozens of them. However, the shoot handle, doorknob, and soda bottle were all wiped clean. All right, let's go visit the wife at the morgue. Maybe she can tell us what he was doing in the city tonight. And if she doesn't know, that tells us something, too. Mm -hmm. But, you yeah. <laughs> Fresh and hot and hot and hot. He doesn't make me coffee. You okay? This is never easy, no matter how much experience you have. I'd call Sam on his cell phone, and he would always answer. I never, never thought I'd be sitting here justifying my marriage. With the wife, it was only call my cell during the week routine. With the fiancé, he pulled out the trusty I can't call you from the hospital act. Man, my girlfriend freaks out if I don't check in like every hour. You do check in like every hour, sometimes more. This guy had both of these women believing that they were his one and only. People believe what they want to believe. Till the dead truth sits in. Well, you think one of them caught on to what Sam was doing? And didn't take too kindly when they discovered they weren't the only woman in his life. Mm, I don't know. They seem pretty shocked to me. Yeah, to me too. But we got to cover all of our bases. Both of them had soft alibis. The wife said that she was watching TV while the kids were upstairs sleeping, and the fiance said that she was home alone, getting ready to meet him. We'll run phone and financial, see if anything pops. Thank you. Could I run right? Do you think he would have gone through with it? Through with what? Marrying Sarah if he hadn't gotten killed. Well, it was a pretty big rock he put on her finger with the fake identity he had set up, the county clerk's office.